everybody, it's Marley, and welcome to another video. And a few days ago in my Spanish class, my Spanish teacher told me about this chocolate that came from a different country. Um, I don't exactly remember what it is at the moment, but here's a clip of me trying. Okay, so right now my teacher is teaching us about how chocolate comes from different parts of the world, and I'm about to try some, so here we go. Guys, that is so nasty. Like, never have real chocolate. It's so nasty. So after tasting the bitter chocolate, I figured, why not prank my siblings? And surprise, surprise, it didn't actually go that well. Don't believe me? Just, just watch. You'll, you'll see. All right. So guys, in front of you is three pieces of chocolate. Now each of you take one. Okay. No, I'm three. I want all of you to eat it. Don't even hesitate. Just go. Ready? What kind of... Well, are you going to tell us what kind of chocolate oh, yeah. it is? This is endangered species chocolate. Endangered species chocolate? That's just the name. There's nothing crazy about it, okay? One, two, three. It tastes kind of bitter, doesn't it? Yeah. That's the point. <laughs> hey. I knew this was going to be bad chocolate. So did I. Uh, it wasn't too good, was it? No. It was uh, too good to be true. What kind of... Yeah, it's endangered species chocolate, like I said. I think it comes from another country. I think it's from, like... Is this oh the only god. chocolate that it's we're going to try? Yeah, it's the only chocolate. Oh my god. Oh, uh, by the way, guys, um, in case you didn't know, THIS WAS A PRANK! <laughs> I got all three of you! So here's the thing. I was trying, like, my teacher was showing me some Spanish chocolate that people made from another country, oh. and it tasted like, like, really bad, so I thought, hey, why don't I get it on my siblings in on the action, you know? <laughs> so, uh, what are your opinions on the chocolate, eh, guys? It was disgusting. Actually, I thought actually... We like yeah, you know what the trick is? You're supposed to let it melt in your mouth. It's still gonna be bitter. You lie. Oh, you don't believe me? Watch me try it myself. It's actually really good if you let it melt in your mouth. And but bear in mind, it's bigger than all the other pieces, so, uh... If you let it melt in your mouth, it may be a smidge bigger than before, but it's still good. You see, you gotta let it melt in your mouth. I didn't tell them that. Because when we all tried it in our class, we just bit right into it firsthand. So, yeah. Then after we bit it first hand, she told us that it's supposed to let it melt in your mouth. So, uh, yeah. Even if it melts in your mouth, it's still bitter. So, uh, yeah. What? what where is it from? Um. Um. I don't really remember. I'll have to look it up. Crap! Oh, in the kitchen, Meg! Are you really supposed to let it melt in your mouth? Yeah. Because I didn't tell you that, and that was the problem. Now it just looks like pure <laughs> poker. <laughs> so, um, how does it feel to know that you guys just got schooled from your, uh, I guess you could say this was a sweet victory. <laughs> a bitter victory. It was bitter chocolate. Uh, Ew. I'm gonna need you back. So, um, I'm just eating over here, in case you didn't know. You can join your chocolate. You can look at all your bitter chocolate faces. You got schooled? You got schooled. You got triple schooled. Why triple? All of you got schooled. Why me triple? I don't know. Because you just feel like it. Damn, it feels good to be a gangster. Well... I guess we're gonna have to hit what? Oh, 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 o